they have a very special matchup for you uh, involving our former champion, Small Town Tyler, and another member of the athletic community here in Calgary. I actually feel really, really lucky that, that this opportunity came up at the timing that it did. Far post, Henry knocks that across. What a moment for Mason Trapper. You know, ever since I was a little kid, I wanted to be a professional soccer player, and, and I'm able to do that now in, in Canada. What could be better? In the red corner at O, O, and O, six foot one, 185, from Boynton Beach, Florida, Mason Mace Dog Trafford. It is the former captain of your Calvary FC, the uh, professional soccer team here in Calgary, Mace Dog, a.k.a. Mason Trafford. Welcome to LWC 17, my friend. Thank you for having me, guys. Now, you are a soccer player. Last week, we had a hockey player, the captain of your Calgary Flames, Michael Backlund, in here, who thought he would put up a good effort against Small Town Tyler. He got whooped pretty hard. Now, what we know about soccer players is their legs are big and strong. How are the calves and how are the quads for you? You know, you did say former captain. I've been retired for about a year now. I'm still in the gym a little bit, but... Uh... We'll see, you know, I, I think I'm good. I think I have some strength, but uh, STT here is a big dude and uh, I saw what he did to Backlund, so I wouldn't be, I, you know, I've done a little bit of homework on him, but I'm, I, I tail a tape, but we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. What kind of preparation did you do this week in anticipation of LWC 17? I YouTubed a little bit. Sure. I, uh, you know, there were some tutorials I saw online and uh, I definitely watched the Backlund fight, which uh, I don't know if that was a smart idea because he's a big dude. He's captain of the Flames and he got roasted. So I, I feel a little bit nervous after that. I probably shouldn't have watched it. Uh, but I'm hoping that like beginner's luck comes in a little bit. I don't have a ton of experience with this, to be honest. Now, Mason, we got a bunch of people on our text line at 929292 talking about the toughness overall of soccer players. I do want to let you know that as a soccer player, we don't have that many medics here to carry you off. I if can't you want fake to fake an, an injury. No, there's no faking injuries. There's no yellow cards. There's no red cards. This is LWC. This is for real. I hope you are ready to take on our massive former champion, Small Town Tyler. In the black corner, with a professional record of 14, 2, and 0. Oh, at 6 foot 1, 250 pounds, from Martinsville, Saskatchewan. The former champion has a name, and it's Small Town Tyler. How are you feeling right now? We're on the road to Legomania for you, May 25th at the Cat and Fiddle. You know, your diet has been in question. Your training has been in question. You're facing another member of the athletic community here in Calgary of the Calvary FC. How are you feeling? I mean, I feel like we're running out of star athletes. We're getting a soccer player in here, but whoa, should be okay. <laughs> now, wow. we're going. now, are you starting to feel like a, like this is a peer of yours? Are you starting to feel like you're on par with all these other athletics that we brought into LWC? Yeah, I mean, it's nice to know that I'm basically a professional athlete at this point. I've beaten a wow. few of them. I'm going to beat another one here in a little bit, so Ooh. I feel good about it. This is the first little glimpse of smugness I've heard from STT over the last what, 16, 17 weeks of LWC? As though he doesn't have a couple of blemishes on his record. You are no longer our champion. I, I don't want to start knocking you down right before a big fight here at LW17, but you are no longer a champion right now. I think you got to flip your mindset here going into this fight. Take this one serious. Okay. I won't take it too lightly. It is the best two out of three uh, leg wrestling match. The object is to force your opponent's knee or thigh to touch the ground while keeping your own knee off the ground. You get fouls for striking, for biting, for scratching, or any other unsportsmanlike behavior. That is strictly prohibited. We do have a soccer player in the building. There are no medics. There are no red cards. There are no yellow cards. Just pure leg wrestling chaos. Our former champion, Small Town Tyler, are you ready? Ready. The former captain of the Calvary FC, Mason Trafford. Are you ready? Ready. Let's get it on! And just like that, the combatants in the hallway locked. Oh! And small Town Tyler with a quick flip. Oh. Hat you hear the agony Mason. there. Wow. We got pain in the hallway? What's going on up there? Talk yeah, to me. the soccer player was a little hurt. It looked like I heard some agony in that voice. Are you boys ready for round two? STT, are you ready? I'm ready. Mason Trafford, are you ready? Let's get it on! Small Town Tyler finds himself up one round to nothing. Oh. They're up and they're over. And Small Town Tyler with a clean sweep of Mace oh. Dog, AKA Mason Trafford. How you feeling, brother? Disappointed. Yeah, but like, I came to a cold realization. That's pretty uh, That's pretty tough. I actually enjoyed it though. I kind of want to get back out there and do, like, <laughs> get a little, get into this sport. No, I, I uh, respect that. No, well played. Now, Mason, as a uh, former professional athlete, Captain of the Calvary FC, how does it feel losing to a man in overalls and a beer belly? 
It feels pretty bad. I'm not going to lie. I'm, uh, I was looking forward to this. I, I was, Like I said, I was looking forward to a little competition here on Friday morning. And, uh, Me too. Yeah, disappointed. Oh, can can yeah. we hear a, a bit of that agony in the voice again like you might have done rolling around on the pitch? Yeah. I'm, we don't you have know the what? benefit of instant There's not replay. much you can do with that. Like, I, I get it. I'm very inexperienced. And if Tyler, he's, he's a big dude. He's strong. He just... The force comes down, and I, I was fighting hard. I actually gave it everything, and you just rolled me, so I, I can't You did can't a great job, much. though. <laughs> yeah. uh, you are taking on a former champion from small-town Saskatchewan where they live and breathe leg wrestling. That was your first go. We appreciate you coming in, buddy. Thanks so much for having me, guys. And I guess we, we got to congratulate the former champion who has added another win to that column, Small Town Tyler. How you feeling? feel good. I mean, uh, it was a little easier than I was expecting. You guys were talking about his legs and all that and how strong he was going to be, but... It was, well, it was pretty easy. Let's not forget, you're 250 pounds on a good day. Mason yeah. Trafford, a buck 85 slim. The guy's got a six pack. The guy's looking great. That was, I guess, an easier competition for you. What changed for you? Did your diet change? Did you get any training in? No, uh, I haven't changed anything. Ever since I lost that last one after eating a salad the night before, I've stuck to the McDonald's diet, and it's been working for me. Did you guys just get that text message? I did. What is that? It's our boss. He wants to have a word with small town Tyler. He says he wants to talk about your performance. I guess okay. we'll, we'll do that before eight o'clock. Sure.